On this international open house, we take you to Paris, France. We're here to show you how the locals live, so let's leave the tourists behind and head to the hood. The 9th arrondissement has a diverse reputation. It's home to the ornate Palais Garnier, which was built to house the Paris Opera. Also calling the 9th home is Timothy Corrigan, a designer and decorator. He chose this neighborhood for its history and for the numerous antique stores and galleries located just blocks from his flat. Hi, welcome to my home. Timothy's spectacular third floor apartment has historical status. And I walked in and I, it was so over the top that I sort of thought, yes, that's my apartment. Over the top is definitely one way of describing this 19th century design. Gilded paneling, crystal chandeliers, 17 foot ceilings, and more doors in each room than you would ever think necessary. The living room alone has two doors from the hall, two sets to the balcony, and hidden behind these 18th century paintings on each wall, two more doors connecting to the adjacent rooms. You see it a lot in the 18th century and the 19th century, and um, all doors were kept closed. When you went into a room, you closed the door, and it provided greater privacy. The apartment's protected status limits any potential change he could make to live here. So he's had to learn to make the most of several of its unusual features. The dining room doubles as his office. But the room's mirror isn't a mirror at all. It's a window into the living room. Mirrors on opposite walls in each room and their matching chandeliers create a disconcerting illusion. When you look down, you truly get a sense of infinity because you get hundreds and hundreds of the chandeliers being reflected in both sets of the mirrors. Another illusion? This ornate corner fireplace doubles as a food warmer for a pass-through to the kitchen. The kitchen is the one room in Timothy's apartment that is decidedly not 19th century. But as someone who is always on the go, it's also the room he uses the least. Considered spacious by Parisian standards, this 1,200-square-foot apartment also has two bathrooms and two bedrooms. But if you decide to unpack and make yourself at home, you'll quickly pick up on another aspect of Paris apartment living. One of the things that you're going to find in just about every single Paris apartment is something like this, an armoire. And the reason is, is that old French apartments just didn't have any closets. That's right. Not one of those doors lead to storage space. In fact, we actually have only one closet in the apartment. You can see it's only big enough to hold some paperback books. I have absolutely no idea what they designed it for and what could possibly have been fit into it. No closets, but a lot of history. Till next time, remember, the best way to know a country and its people is to get inside the incredible homes they live in on International Open House.